if ever there was an example that critics are completely out of touch with reality, it would be the Proud family. Look at that right there. 100% critic rating to an 11% audience rating. Now, of course, there's only six reviews in. Although television, especially television on something like this, it's not going to have as many reviews as uh, your typical movie or your even your big budget movies or even your mid-level movies. It's not going to have that many. I don't know how many it'll ultimately have, but there is only six reviews in. But the fact that it's at 100% with six reviews, the fact that there are six people out there that gave this a positive review with the nonsense we have seen is truly next level. 11% from the audience a 89% discrepancy between the audience and the critics. We have seen this time and time again. And the Proud family is probably one of the worst examples of wokeness we have seen in a long, long time. And that speaks volumes considering how bad current entertainment is. Look at this clip right here. It is nothing more than social justice propaganda for kids. This is insanity to me. This is this is this is something that Disney made for children. I want to put that in full perspective here. Disney made this for children. Officers, please put these little kids in cuffs, y'all. Audience, no photos, please. They are they are actively encouraging children to resist the police officers. Think about that for a minute. Resist the police officers, disrespect the police officers. That's what it's trying to do. And there it is. There it is. One more time. One more time. Here we go. They're going to arrest our baby. Do something with your white privilege. Unbelievable. And that is why you're sitting at an 11% audience score. But of course, the woke critics out there, the critics that define everything off of race, gender, and sexual orientation, and the message, they think it's got a 100%, ladies and gentlemen, because this is wokeness at its finest right here wokeness is a disease social justice warriors they are a disease and they want to infect everything that they can and the proud family is the latest example of this nonsense you guys let me know your thoughts in the comments below thank you very much for checking out this video and we will talk to you later